Automotive, is a premium IoT trainer kit, developed for making today's engineers ready for tomorrow. Launched at the Cisco Academy National Conference, organized in India, February 2017, where it was used in the training of, professors from all over the country. The kit was highly recommended by Cisco dignitaries and the professors. Why IOTIF? This kit is made in India. Premium quality and best in class OEM products. Plug and play design. Easy installation and upgradation of labs. Product prototyping and project development. Exposure to embedded systems and Internet of Things. Measuring humidity and temperature using a DHT sensor, and displaying the same on an LCD and thing speak. This is the IOTIF trainer kit. We connect the power supply, 5 volts and 4 amperes, which powers the complete board. Now, we connect the Ethernet cable to access the Raspberry Pi through our laptop. And, finally, we power our Raspberry Pi. The other connections are made afterwards, that is, the DHT sensor and the LCD. To connect to the Raspberry Pi through our computer, we use PUT-T. Enter. Raspberry Pi dot local. Terminal window opens up, log into your RPI using, Pi as login ID and Raspberry as password. We enter the configuration settings, and go to interfacing, to enable I2C. Restart the system by using the command, sudo reboot. This is the IOTIF manual, which contains number of experiments, designed by our technical team, to make the user comfortable with the kit, and learn concepts of IOT. We, now, go to our required experiment, which conatins all the steps. Follow those steps. First, we install the I2C tools. And, then, we search for, the address of our LCD. Note that, using hyphen Y in the command might give, error at times. You can use the command without that as well. As it can be seen, the LCD is detected with the address 38. Note that. Install git using the following command. Clone the Audafruit DHT libraries to your RPI. We have already done that, 
So, moving on to the next step. Now, we will change our directory, to the library folder we just installed. And install the setup using the following command. Afterwards, we access the examples directory. After navigating to the examples folder, we install the required LCD drivers. Then, we make a script file, and write the code. In our case, we already have the code written. Here, as you can see, we have imported all the required libraries. This is the LCD address we had found out, 0x38. Here, we are taking the values of, humidity and temperature, from the DHT sensor. And, then, writing it to the LCD. Now, we go to the ThingSpeak website. You can sign in using your MathWorks account. After signing in, create a new channel. Give it a name, and make two fields, for humidity and temperature. Copy the right API key, and paste it in your code. Now, using Ctrl and X, save the file, come back to the terminal window. Now, run the code. As it can be seen, the readings start coming on your screen, and, also, on the LCD. If you open the private view tab on ThingSpeak, you can also see the graphs being generated. We have a list of more than 70 experiments which can be conducted on the IOTIF trainer kit. Thank you. You can contact us at 